WFNN. Headline News Update. Hi folks, Basil Chapman here for the 11 o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. This is the last trading day of March. Uh, on Monday we'll be able to look at those March candles, those April candles starting because March will be done and that's going to be really important. In the, in the meantime, you can see a, a long-legged doji, not quite a doji at this particular point. Uh, if we drop about 80 points or so, it'll be kind of a doji candle there. We're looking at the S&P, which is also up quite nicely. It does up 178, 33,038. S&P, if I can get that right there. There it is. The S&P is trading at, um, got it, there we go. S&P is up 25 at 4,076 in leg D, the Dow's only in leg C. There should be a pullback to make a peak C and then a leg D, and that's your target in the Chevrolet buy signal to buy mode. Then you have to assess to see can other things happen uh, from that particular point. Looking at the QQQ, look, here's the daily chart on the left. Uh, the middle one's just not updating. So the one on the left is uh, very nice in leg C. So the QQQs also need to make uh, a peak. Oh, sorry, the, the s and has already gone to a leg D, but the the Qs are only at C. So this is a pullback and then a D going into uh, earliest. We can make a peak D is Wednesday. IWM, Russell 2000, uh, trading nicely up 273 at 177.91. Gold contract is uh, pulling back just a little bit. Yeah, it's kind of stuck in a range between, uh, I'd say, 2005 and 1950. 1948 says it's starting to move down. So we're watching that closely. The dollar, uh, the dollar's just kind of stuck here, yeah, up 15 ticks at 102.33. Now, this is very interesting. I didn't have a chance to do my shortened program. I could only do a half an hour. Uh, TLT right now is up 100 at 105.41, up 61. So yields are pulling back just a little bit. I think yields are just stuck in a range. I didn't even get to crude oil. Crude oil is uh, in leg B to the upside. Oh, I never did natural gas. I want to do natural gas. Natural gas is up. Woohoo! 0.08 on the continuous contract at 218. Uh, this is a very important moment because this, uh, the on-balance volume is turning up. But that flat stochastic at 7.10 says a lot of work needs to be done to get that to 15%. So we're we'll watching that closely. But in the meantime, I'm going to say to you, have a wonderful weekend. I will see you Monday. Stay tuned for great programming. And let's hope it's a beautiful weekend here in the Boston area. See you on Monday. Thanks for being here.